that don't really know me, my name's Alondra. And uh, I started this YouTube channel when we were traveling. We're still doing a little bit of traveling, but we thought today we'd do a little bit, um, something a little bit different. We are going to be baking some Christmas cookies. Yay! Okay, so let me show you guys what we have for today's baking session. So we have our measuring cups um, that we're going to be using. Our little special mixing thingy that I don't know what it's called, so we call it the mixing thingy. We have our shapers for our cookies and obviously the cooking pans. We have some cookie icing. We decided to go with red, more like green, red and white. Then we have our little sprinkles, our vanilla extract and a baking stick, which is kind of like baking powder. More um, sugar decorating things for the cookies. Our baking soda that I opened just a minute ago to try to do a little bit of an experiment. Ex experiment. Experiment. So, oh, okay, so we have our sugar right here and our all purpose flour. So, we don't actually, so we recently moved to our apartment, so we don't really have a mixing bowl, so we thought we'd use this. And then we also have. Um, gingerbread house that we're going to be building together while we wait for the cookies to bake. So that's why that, uh, that is sitting right there. So yeah, let's get started. Okay guys, so we're going to get started now. So let me actually pull up that recipe. This is what we went off. We've never really baked. I'm not really a kitchen person. So we had to look it up to see what ingredients we needed. So I'm just gonna go uh, based off on the same recipe, based on the things that we bought. So we're gonna start off with two, um, two three fourths of flour. Or on. Let's open this up. Since I can't really put music on here, guys, I don't know if you guys mind me singing. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna come out of nowhere. Here goes the flower. One. Two. Three. And then another. You better watch out. You better not cry. <laughs> I'm sorry, I scared Jose. Yeah, I said one tablespoon of baking soda. This is one tablespoon. And then half tablespoon of baking powder. There's no baking powder. <laughs> Okay, so we realized we forgot to buy baking powder, powder. so we are going to skip that and kind of see how that turns out. So here we go on to the next step. So now we need one cup of softened butter. I actually have to Google that because I wasn't sure what that meant. Um, so one cup of butter, let's see. So we need this kind of thing. Oh no. We'll get that later. We'll see how much it is. I think it's probably gonna be the almost the whole stick, if not the whole stick. But let's just make sure we have the right amount. So here we are. Almost the whole stick. Might as well put the whole thing in there, right? I should have checked how much this was before even doing all of this, but okay, so we'll just put that in there now. Okay, so 
so here I have the egg, the one egg that is needed. So there it goes in there. Should probably have a napkin over here. Um, let's see. So one tablespoon of vanilla extract. Here we are. Opening this up now. Are you guys excited for Christmas? I know I am. I really haven't done any, any Christmas shopping or anything, but I'm very excited. Um, that was harder than I thought it would be. But here we are. There goes that. And Okay, that looks like that's about it. So now I guess we just mix it. I've never done this, guys. So. Okay, so now I am just getting together this dough, which is looking very good and it's definitely taking the breath out of me, but it's looking quite good. Um, I think we should be good now. So there we go. Okay, so now we are just putting the cookie paper. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Here I am back again, guys. We finished with the cookies. As you can tell, they're ready to be put in the oven. So if you wanna come right over, come right over here with me. I'll show you where the oven is at. So we are baking at uh, 375 degrees. So we are ready to put the cookies in the oven. Grab my mittens and put this back or in there. Here goes our other pad in the oven.
So we are going to be baking for about 10 to 15 minutes or until the cookies are a little bit golden and then we are going to be taking them out to decorate. In the meantime, we are going to start that gingerbread okay, house. Okay, so now we are going to get started on this gingerbread house. We are waiting for the cookies to finish baking so we can start decorating. So Jose is actually going to join me for this part. And here he comes. <laughs> so here we have the cookies. I'm not sure what this is or any of this stuff, but okay. Oh, I think that's the the thing where you stick it. So I'm guessing we put this here. Okay, let's see how this is going. Are you adding some Christmas lights? Ooh, can't see. What about the doorknob? <laughs> Good enough, dude. What a house. Looks like it's melting. <laughs> it's snowing. That's why. So what are you making? Tell us. A candy cane tree. So we're just going to do a contest to see who 
decorate some the best, which of course is gonna be me. Yeah, that's gonna go to the beginning of the Okay, please don't discriminate here. So here we go. Let's start. Okay everyone, so we have reached the end of the video. As um, you guys can see, we actually did finish decorating our cookies. These are Jose's cookies right here. You can see Jose's cookies are right here. And my cookies are right over here. Yay! I think I won, to be honest. No, it's right. Look, I got the Grinch and you don't. It's melting. Okay, so in my opinion, I think I actually won this contest, but maybe not. Let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to click the little subscribe button and the little bell so that you get notified when we upload a new video. We should be having a lot of them coming very soon um, and very close together. Well, every week at least we're gonna try to upload. And my social medias are down below in the description. Merry Christmas, happy holidays, everything. Thank you so much for joining us. See you guys next time.